All right, so we're here today to talk about how to start your own YouTube channel and what you need. I'll tell you it's the easiest thing to get started, okay? You need three things. One, you need your phone. Two, you need an app so that you can edit. I got two apps for you on that one. Three, you just need content. Content. Tell them saying content. That's it. You got to be able to talk about something. It doesn't matter what it is. Talk about something. That's what it is. All right. So number one on the list, you need your phone. Check this out. Nowadays, phones shoot in 4K. Okay. They've got the dual camera system. So I don't understand why you can't. You don't have to go out and spend $800 on a DSLR, which... If you get really good and into making videos, then yes, that would be the professional route to go to get that cinematic look that you're looking for. With a standard phone camera, your iPhone 10, your, I use the Note 8, the Note 9, I mean, they have phenomenal cameras. Did you have boogers come out? Anyways, they have phenomenal cameras and you can get a lot done. Like right now, I'm using the front facing camera. It looks great. 60 frames a second. I mean, I don't understand how much better you want from that. I mean, I don't, it's great. All right, so the number two thing that I brought up is you need an app, okay? So I use uh, the GoPro app Quick, and I also use another app called Viva Video. 90% um, of my videos are done on Quick. Uh, a lot of the things that I use on Viva Video is so that I can overlay the uh, my logo and stuff on top of things. Uh, I think it's a dollar a month, dollar twenty-five a month to use it, and I use it. It's got some really great transitions on that app. Um, I have done at least two vlogs on there where I've just edited and done, put the music on there, used the transitions on there, uh, and it, there are some really good transitions on there that I like using. Um, so what I have been doing here recently is bouncing back and forth, um, putting a couple clips together in Viva Video, exporting, putting them back into the quick. Uh, and kind of doing that thing. Um, the reason I like to use the Quick app, um, if it's just something I'm throwing together really quick, uh, which are a lot of my videos, um, it detects the beats that are within the song and matches the transitions in the video to the song, which is extremely helpful. Now, the number three thing that I talked about is content. I mean, like I'm doing today, we're talking about how to start a channel, and you can talk about how babies love dogs. You could talk about why it's so god-awful hot in Alabama. Also, why is it so hot and I'm outside in a long sleeve that I've been wearing all day? Why do babies talk like that? Why do babies babble? Somebody tell me why babies babble. Bottom line, if you want to start a YouTube channel, do it. You have the resources. Take advantage of it. If you have a phone, you have the opportunity to create do it and just practice it put it up there and people will like it if they like it they don't guess what it doesn't matter it's all about growth all about growth here learning to do something new all right so one tip uh as you can see it looks like i'm looking off into the distance and i'm really bad about this so what i'm doing is i'm looking at the screen to make sure everybody's in the screen at the same time don't worry about that uh I say don't worry about that. You can jump over and look at the screen real quick, but really focus on your camera because now it looks like I'm looking directly at you guys and I'm talking to you guys rather than I'm talking to somebody off in the distance and I'm a weirdo who has two lazy eyes and I just look off into the corner. But now I'm looking at you and it's more personal. And I'm really bad about that because I'm always looking at the screen to make sure everything I want in the screen is in the screen. But I'm getting away from that. Promise.